them say Our best days pass us by And most long for a place that they never find I'm afraid Guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel And for today guys, we are going to prepare pasture and meatballs so to start with, we have our pasture here. This is the type of pasture I'm going to use. And then we have tomato paste here, beef cubes here. And then we have our tomatoes here, our pounded garlic and ginger, our, our onions here, our diced onions here. We have our coriander leaves here. We have our capsicum and coriander stems on this plate and then here comes our meatballs guys so we are going to prepare tomato sauce pasture and meatballs so guys for the meatballs i have another video already it's up so you have to watch that video first to know how to prepare the meatballs for this video i'm going to do it halfway so stay tuned as we get through the whole video but i already have the meatball video up and you can watch it before you come and watch this so that we will be on the same page stay tuned guys as we get through hope you enjoy already done here so i'm just going to set them aside and then i prepare their sauce so i'm just setting them here aside so guys i'm going to fry up my onions so that's what i'm just doing here you make sure your oil is hot so let's fry them until they're golden brown guys my onions are already done i'm going to add my garlic and then cook it up a little bit until I can smell its flavors. Mm -hmm. Nice one. And then to this, guys, I'm going to add my capsicums because I don't want my garlic to burn down. My capsicums and coriander stems. I'm going to add my tomatoes now and cook them up and add a little bit salt and cover them so that they cook up completely. My tomatoes are already well cooked. I'm going to add in my tomato paste. And then after that, I'm going to add my cubes and then cook them a little bit up and then add my meatballs here, guys. So to this, I'm going to add my cubes. a little bit this tomato sauce and make sure they are well drained in them guys so that's what we are just doing here and after that I'm going to cover them up for like about 30 minutes so that they may cook up so let's do it Pasture. 
and then I'm going to have, what is this kukoroga <laughs> I'm going to stir them until they get flat so guys we are going to cook these up we are going to three quarter cook them so that we, we might add them to our tomato sauce meatballs or meatballs cooked in tomato sauce and that's our supper for today guys and this is how you prepare pasture and meatballs guys so, so guys we are going to let them boil uh, for about five to seven minutes and they will be well cooked so we are going to drain off the water and then add them to our to our meatballs so that's what we are doing here precisely just boiling them in hot water and salt I'm going to add my pasture to this and then just let them cook up guys and this is what I'm going to have for supper today so I'm going to cover them up and reduce the heat and let them cook up before I mix them to get all together so guys I'm going to mix my uh, meatballs with the pasture and then I'm, they are ready to serve guys and this is how you prepare them it's just simple and less time taking and the most delicious meal kindly remember to like share and subscribe I'm going to garnish this with some corianders and we call it a deal let me show you how they look with garnished corianders guys so guys I'm gonna garnish my my meal here and that's how it goes kindly remember to like share and subscribe 